And tonight, firefighters battling the Creek Fire in Fresno and Madera counties are starting to get the upper hand. Containment now at 16 percent. The fire has burned more than 212,000 acres. Our Kirsten Mitchell is at Sierra High School, the Fresno County Incident Command Center, where some residents today were allowed to return home. Some evacuation orders turned into warnings that includes residents living in the yellow zones on this map. Many communities west of the Creek Fire in Madera County and then down in Fresno County new today. People near Pine Flat Lake can also go back. But for those who lost homes, it could still be a while. It's, it's exciting when you have somebody in your community, community that has a home, which is kind of a weird thing to say, but it kind of gives you hope. Sierra High School principal Sean Osterberg is still finding reasons to smile. Standing outside his school, which is now a Creek Fire Command Center. Like so many families of the 600 students there, they evacuated. I, I left the, sh the chickens. But um, took everything else. So we knew we knew once it got over Crestman's and the way Crestman's burned that we were we most likely lost our home. The Creek Fire really tore through the Pine Ridge community. All around me, as far as the eye can see, are just skeletons of trees. Many homes here are also destroyed. And the only real way you can tell where a home was standing is because what's left behind, in many cases, it's just the chimney. My house burnt down. The garage burnt down. All my outbuildings burnt down. But the chicken coop, and it still had some chickens alive in them giving him, his wife, and his two girls something to celebrate. You kind of have a few pieces of home still, so it's pretty, pretty nice. Their home is one of more than 470 structures destroyed. Fortunately, those numbers are continuing to go up a little bit. Those areas were so heavily damaged, there was a lot of t uh, trees that were coming down, and it was not safe for the assessment crews to get in there. Losing your home is very traumatic, and it's going to be a, a new journey. I mean, it's going to be a tough one, but... Um, I still have my family. I still have great friends and, and a community that we're all going through it. Cal Fire says damage assessment is now 43% complete. And there is some good news in Madera County. Crews say the fire is continuing to move up toward the wilderness, away from communities. So tonight, fire crews will be working to keep it that way. Reporting in Fresno County, Kirsten Mitchell, KC24, local news that matters.